Okay, so today we're going to walk through how to add a new directory to your section of the handbook um, so that if one of these links on your table of contents on the right hand side um, were not an anchor link on this page, it would actually lead to another page un nested underneath the social marketing page. Uh, so what we're going to do, we're just going to scroll down and edit this page like we normally do to set up a merge request. And then I'm actually going to go back to the social marketing um, directory from the breadcrumbs up here. So you can see I can go to the corporate marketing folder, so on and so forth up here. So this is where you want to add your folder, Will? Yes. Okay. So what I'm going to do to add that is I'm going to click the plus sign up here and I'm going to create a new directory from this directory. So I'm in a new directory. Um, typically the directories are just lowercase. It doesn't really matter um, because it's not shown on the front end. So what is the name of the folder or directory that you want? So uh, my intent of this page is to move all of the administrative uh, guidelines for handbook updates, issues, the way we work into it. So I would likely use this as an admin page. Okay. Is it cool if I just call it admin then? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. And I'm just going to call this new directory admin, and I'm just going to use my typical branch name here, create directory. Okay, and I'm going to go ahead and make this whip um, because we have a couple more steps that we need to do to make this work. Okay. Submit. Now I'm going to go back into that branch and I'm going to open it in a new tab. And unfortunately, I do now have to navigate back um, to that section of the handbook. Is it under social media guidelines or are you guys it under be it's corporate, corporate marketing. marketing? Okay. Yeah. Social marketing. Okay. Now we can see we have that new directory and I'm going to go into it, but we don't have the index.html. Right. And so that's what I'm going to add now. I'm going to add that file so you can actually add markdown to that. So again, from this folder, I'm going to click the plus sign and I'm going to do new file. And then in the file name, you're going to want to put index.html.md for markdown. You don't need to select a template type. And then to have a new page have the table of contents, there's a little snippet, and I'll send it to you um, after this so that you can hang on to it. And I'm just going to copy that and paste it here. Obviously, I took this from my Path Factory page. So what do you want the title of the page to be? Social media administration. Okay. And I'm going to say add new social media admin page. And just to give it a little bit of um, content before, I'm just going to put something here and you can delete it in the next commit. That's not a word, y'all. <laughs> you know what? We're going with it. You should have left it. We could have went with it. That's all right. I haven't finished my coffee yet. <laughs> We're just going to go with that. OK, commit changes. OK, <clears throat> and now I can see 
it's already set that up for me and the changes are committed. So I'll go back to my merge request and I can see it added that there. And that is how you add a new directory and a new file with table of content ready um, on the handbook.